So just by looking at these three images, could you tell which one is pleural effusion, lung abscess and empyema? By the end of this video, you will be able to. But before we look at the images, let's look at the definition. An empyema is the accumulation of pus within the pleural cavity, but a lung abscess is the accumulation of pus within the lung parenchyma. Pleural effusion is the accumulation of fluid within the pleural cavity, which can be either transudative or exudative, based on the light's criteria. With all of these entities, patients can present with fever, chills, cough, and chest pain. On imaging, there are few clues that tell them apart. Pleural effusions are located within the pleural cavity. They often have a dependent position, which means dorsally on a CT or basally on an erect chest x-ray. This also means that the pleural effusion is often crescentic in shape. With pleural effusions, there is a thin, imperceptible pleural surface on CT, but make sure not to confuse the adjacent atelectasis with an enhancing pleura. While empyema is also located within the pleural cavity, it tends to form an obtuse ankle with a pleural wall, giving it a biconcave shape. Empyema may also show an incomplete border sign, indicative of extrapulmonary location. The pleura is usually thickened and enhancing with the empyema, which will show the split pleural sign on CT. Lung abscess is located within the lung parenchyma, so it tends to have a spherical shape with thick walls and narrow contact with the chest wall. Bronchovascular markings will also be seen to extend towards the abscess, and often the abscess is surrounded by consolidations.